God damn. Did he get shot? God damn. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy you done get it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leonum Tumkulu, South African Geek. Welcome to my channel. About to dive right into the final episode of season one of C2. I don't know if it's going to get a season two or not, but I really enjoy season one either way. Like, I really enjoy Jupiter's Legacy, even though we got to say bye bye to that show. <laughs> the previous episode found out devastating news that Gus was experiment number one. Um, Birdie was the scientist, the lead scientist. Looks like the government and Birdie had an altercation that led to the virus being released to the world and creating hybrids. Gus lost it, understandably. This one is going to be the longest episode. I think it's like 50 something minutes. Let's not waste any more time. It's about to be a treacherous ending. Because this. God damn, that, old, that episode only focused on Gus and his parents, essentially. So this episode has to catch up on what's happening to the doctor, Amy, Gus and everything. That's why it's so long. Anyway, let's not waste any more time. Started with a drone shot. Sweet too. Why wouldn't it be? This dude is vaping. So this episode starts with two random dudes. It's like the Mandalorian episode. <laughs> Think the end of season one. This dude has given up hope. <laughs> These guys are being massively childish. Ooh. That his wife? We actually gonna see him lose his kid and his wife? God damn. They're still humans at least. What's with the flashback heavy episodes? His wife is fine. <laughs> they didn't want a hybrid kid. Damn, look how small they are in comparison to him. God damn. It's legit on some COVID shit. The whole re reality is broken. I didn't even think about that. They're still acting tough with each other. This dude's throwing away the books now. This is gonna throw away dog. This dude is having a full brown tantrum. What the hell is that? Is that a plane? It's the dude who's thrown over the flyers. Or... Whoever it was, the plane is still on. Oh, the Amy story is back. The prosthetics for this show, though. Damn. They brought a whole army, dog. That's overkill right there, dog. <laughs> you didn't have to go over the cars. God damn, they hit in all the traps. The notification traps. It's the general. How did they know it was her? Haha, <laughs> NASA with a tank. Woo, it's a full blown war. God damn. Who's getting pissed off? Start moving, kids. That should be the tagline for the show a love letter to nature. God damn. Damn. Oh, they were waiting for the loud booms. Damn. Look at how scared he was for a second. Did she get away? <laughs> They're at the church. Took them all night to get to the church. How far is the church? They speak in sign language. Where did Bobby go? Damn. She didn't smell them. Damn. Not the kids. Damn. Uh, they caught the kids. What are they doing? What are they doing? God damn. General just bad to be more evil than everybody else. Is he in charge of this army or is, is he following orders too? God damn. He's really on that evil tip. They got the kids, yeah. Oh. Maybe just two of them? I don't think they looked down the sword. Damn, they actually got all of them. 
Did he have a hybrid kid? Yep, he had a hybrid kid. Damn. He ran away? Don't tell me he dished his wife and kid. He dished them? Shit. So they've met before? Oh, so he didn't ditch? That's a ship. Just remembering her childhood. Everybody's reliving the trauma this time. Was her little sister a hybrid? She understands the sisterhood metaphor. So it's such a slow burn. We have kids that are taken. Save them kids. Also, bear and big man are just beside you while you're alone. What did he do? Did he ditch your kid, man? So he didn't run away? So what happened to his wife and kid? God damn, they took them. Damn. God damn. Did he get shot? God damn. Gus got big man killed. Is this how Gus is gonna be put next to the other kids? Damn, this season's really gonna end so traumatic. Damn. Yo, General's just mad fucked up. Did they deliver Gus first? Yeah. Uh, He's not gonna do it. Do you still want any chocolate bars? Woo hoo hoo. Him speaking back. So he saved Gus? They didn't hear the gunshot? That was so loud though. Bear's a cool thing for a kid. The trauma episode. Let's do it. <laughs> Murder galore. Children missing. Wife and kid missing. Getting shot. Is her little sister? The girl dropped at the zoo? They left the six year old alone? God damn, these people are fucked up. So they were, so were they that close? Tiger betrayed you that much? God damn. Did he just pass out or is he dead? He's gonna get saved. Is that Birdie? Or is that Amy? Oh, he's still alive. What a cliffhanger ending though. I know it's gonna end on this tip. God damn, the lizard kid took your place? He's actually going through with it? Yo. Damn. I knew it. She is totally the girl. Your sister's with Gus. God damn. Tell me he didn't see the other kids this whole time. Gus has friends. Oh, Wendy and Gus can talk to each other. Welcome to the family. Group hug. That's how they're gonna end it. This show better get renewed. <laughs> better get renewed. There's a end credit scene. <laughs> Is that Birdie? Ho oh, oh, ho, Birdie's still alive! Twist! Yo, so much happened in this episode. <laughs> so much happened. Man. I was wondering why it was slowing down the past two episodes, but slowing it down so it gets a cliffhanger ending is a smart move if it gets renewed. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? God damn, I hope it gets renewed. What a great episode. They go on a war. Big man and Amy gotta team up. Save them kids. Feel like a few of them are gonna get experimented on though. Bye bye lizard kid. God damn. Birdie's still alive. Talking to Bear. Who's Wendy's sister. Yo, it's so it's all so connected. The doctor helped big man in the hospital to go back to his wife but his wife got taken and his kids his kid i mean god damn so much i feel like there's another twist that his wife is still somewhere <laughs> also it's gonna be a reunion also with that situation man there's so much happening yo that was a great season i give the season like a i said eight eight out of ten did have some pacing problems, was slow at times. It's a really great love letter to nature though. She just went to the um, 
not Paul again, probably trying to find a cure for the virus. She probably feels guilty. She's going to come back when she finds out that Gus is still alive, though. Like, Gus? Are you sure? I'm coming back, I 